Uh, hey guys, today I want to talk to you about uh, responsible decluttering, uh, how I managed to sell my my stuff, how I managed to declutter my stuff, uh, to donate it. And uh, this is probably a part two of the video uh, I recorded uh, a while ago. This is a kind of an update and uh, I hope it will be interesting. Uh, and uh, enjoyful. Maybe uh, you will get some insight or important information out of that. So uh, recently I talked about uh, my relationship with uh, people who come to um, to collect the, the stuff, the things I donate. Because we have uh, this uh, special special web pages, special uh, community pages where you can uh, post um, all the information you ha you you have about your um, about the things you want to donate and um, people who are interested uh, can get uh, can contact you and um, collect your stuff. So and uh, most of the time I uh, I've encountered that uh, those people they are really strange. Because um, I don't know um, the kind of people who are really monitoring uh, this uh, these posts about uh, free stuff, uh, and it's not uh, like this is some of new stuff. Usually, it's uh, secondhand stuff, and um, lots of the time, it's really, really. I, th I consider the stuff I am donating sometimes it's barely the things I don't really go to declutter to the trash because some some of the things can be uh, used up like for example some cosmetics or some mm, I don't know some kitchenware I don't really need uh, something like that and um, so most of the time <laughs> people were very strange and they when they uh, came and grabbed the stuff they most of them or some of them they didn't even say things and I was really surprised because, well, after all this, uh, although that stuff wasn't really brand new, but it had uh, some value still. And I I was, uh, I don't know, I was discouraged really. And uh, there were a few times where I was so disappointed uh, after um, those kind of meetings with those people that I just plainly uh, got all my things I, I wanted to donate uh, to the trash because I couldn't bear um, communicating with uh, those kind of people. But recently I've discovered a, a small trick and if you have the same um, exchange uh, social, social uh, communities in your country, in your town, uh, maybe you can also um, take my trick um, for you. So every time, uh, although um, it is considered to be free, all the stuff, but more, um, some people, uh, they really offer something in exchange, like maybe some uh, chocolate bar or just some something to thank uh, a person for all the things uh, they get for free. And I think it's a really normal um, process because it's like karma balance. If you if you receive something, you should give, uh, give something um, uh, also, and um, after that, I um, I told all the people who came to collect my things that it would be very nice if uh, if it was possible for them to bring me any any fruits. And uh, so what I've discovered was that those kind of people who really who, who were okay with uh, bringing me something back. Mm, they were normal people actually it was it wasn't like uh, a homeless person coming to me taking myself and then <laughs> just saying bye and I think this is uh, the way we can also uh, help those people because you know everything that you uh, receive it's not it's not free you pay your energy you pay um, your health you pay your time and uh, this way you can help uh, those people uh, to pay you back and this is a small sm very small amount of uh, money something like that because uh, for example it's only like a dollar 
um, a kilo of fruit uh, in our country where I live, it's can be a dollar, just a dollar. And I think it's such a small thing and you don't give money directly. You can, you can, well, if they brought me, for example, just one orange, I would be okay as well because it's, it's just uh, a simple token of exchange. It's just a token of appreciation. So uh, this is why I think that this is a good thing to, to think about. Uh, because uh, if you got, uh, give something for free, it's not really valued. And I've noticed that uh, most, uh, lots of people who come to collect my things, they take everything. And uh, sometimes they don't need even half of the stuff they take. And I think that if you just give it away mindlessly and person uh, takes it also mindlessly, it's just putting a trash uh, and I want to stop from one flat to another or from one point to another. So it's really, it has very few, very little value in it. So this was my message to you, small, a small one, uh, just my observation of the situation. So I'm, I'm really glad that I've discovered for myself this one. And I, th I hope um, that would be that my uh, responsible decluttering system will approve after that. So if you like this video, please uh, push like, subscribe to my channel and comment uh, what do you think about my decluttering process and share your secrets as well. So see you in the next one. Bye bye.